Welcome back to another video about um, my world, my life, uh, and things that I find interesting and that I love. And one of the things that I love to do is drink coffee. This isn't how to make the perfect coffee, it's just how I make coffee. I have some coffee and it's like, uh, how are we going to make it today? How are we going to cook the coffee? How are we going to get it going? So first thing I'm going to do is boil the kettle. That's, that's going to come in handy later. You'll see why. So that'll just uh, take a couple minutes to get, get boiled up. Um, but while that's happening, I'll get out my tools that I need to make the coffee. Tools of the trade. We're going to be using Chemex today. And we've got um, Supreme Coffee. It's actually been ground. Being ground already. I often drink water when I have coffee because coffee can dehydrate you. Something else we need to get ready is a set of scales. And I don't mean da -da 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 -da. I mean set of scales. Alright, so the kettle's boiled. Finally. Who's to say really what's more popular? Coca-Cola or coffee? Both share some letters, C and O. Um, yeah, so we're going to be using a two cup recipe. First thing we're going to do though, we're going to rinse the filter. I, I don't have Chemex filters, I just have this other third party filter, but it's a lot easier because you don't have to do the fold thing, which is where you fold it in half and then in half again. We don't need to worry about that today with this kind of filter. So I'm just going to wet it. So by pouring water over this, it basically it wets the filter. Uh, and from and as far as most people are concerned, that's really good. I'm gonna wet it a little bit more because it didn't get wet all the way. Take the filter out. All right. So I'm gonna now measure out. I made a spill. I made a spill. No, it's perfect. We're gonna be using 42 grams of coffee today. Yeah, 42 grams. Okay, it's, it just seems like a lot. So it's been a while since I've done this. I think I've lost the original recipe and so it just seems like too, ma too much. Yeah, it says 34 grams. So I'm gonna um, get rid of some of these grams. Uh, eight of the grams we have to get rid of now. Still need to get rid of three more grams. Sorry, it's a little bit embarrassing to do this on the video. I got the number wrong. Never mind. And, and 510 grams of water. So I'm resetting that. Also seems like a lot of, lot of water, but um, let's try it. I'm gonna put my thumb on the paper because I'm worried it's gonna slip through. If I burn myself, it's not intentional. And I hope no one burns themselves doing that. But let's see, so you got to be really gentle with this. So you wet it a little bit, then let it absorb. I think maybe this isn't a good filter. We do what we can. We do what we can. Uh, so that's 47 grams, and I need to be getting up to uh, 510 grams of water. I keep adding this. It takes a long time to seep. Seep, seep through, and unfortunately, we, we can't rush. The, we can't rush it. Um, it just takes time. Now you'll see there's like a little kind of nipply thing on the Chemex. That is basically where we need to stop. So whether or not I've got to 510 grams doesn't really matter. Once I get to that point, so we'll see what happens first. If I get 510 first, we'll stop. If we get to 510, I'll stop. But if we get to the nipple before we get to 510, then I'll stop. I'm stopping either way. Almost there. I might call it actually, because I, I don't want a, a mega coffee. Well, I think I'm happy. I'm happy with that. This is going to round out to maybe 430 grams of water, which is a cup of uh, 215 grams. Uh, when you drink coffee, it's usually in a small cup. Speaking of which, uh, I want to show you my cups. So, I have these um, Bodum cups that are vacuum, they have like a vacuum in them. 
or glass, but they're great for coffee because you can see the coffee. Basically looks like it's done now. So uh, we're going to move on to the next step. So this is kind of a, a long black or Americano style coffee. It's very hot. That was boiling water I was pouring over that. So we actually don't need the scale anymore. And then my partner and I are going to enjoy a nice glass or mug of Americano coffee. Try and make it 50 50. Anyway, th these are some coffees. I'm going to put a bit of milk in mine. So there's a Zymo, a Zymo, Zymo lactose milk. You could put cream in it. If I had a bell, I'd be like, ding, coffee's up. So we can have coffee now. Thanks everyone for listening. Thanks everyone for watching. I love making these. Uh, please show your support. Your, please show some support and then I'll keep doing it. Like and subscribe, share it around, uh, tell people about it. Thanks so much.